Hey what's up guys once again welcome back to my channel so today we are designing a rectangular T type of duct so this is the 3d model of duct design this is the T form which is usually by made with sheet metals this is the heavy type of design heavy duct design so let's start so firstly go to the part then select all the planes and click on show now select front plane and click on sketch firstly we need to draw the T profile so we go with the line command by using line command we can draw the T profile so let me draw the random, random lines If we create T profile, then we can give the dimension to it. So let me give the dimensions. Firstly, we need to complete the T profile. This is complete. So go to the smart dimensions and give the dimension or the height to the T as 1 meter that is 1000 mm and the bottom length of the T is 500 mm which means we creating a duct of 500 mm in the width so let me complete all the dimensions this also has 500 mm because we are designing a duct of 500 into 600 mm that is the 500 as length and 600 as height that we can complete within next part that is our side duct side duct or the, you can say side wall of the duct which is adjacent to that T so our sketch is complete then go to the sheet metal go to the base flange and select the thickness as 5 mm I already said that to you this is the heavy duct design which is already which is used in industry only for the sugar ducts and other works then we need to create the side profile of the T that's why we selecting the rectangular command so let me give the dimension to it as I say the height of the duct is 600 mm so we are choosing here 600 mm and click on ok now exit sketch Again go to the sheet metal, go to the base flange. Now this time we need to create a chamfer in between that so we can weld it the gap between that ducts so it can already take the 5 mm fillet during welding. You can see here we match the plate to the edges that makes helps that helps us to maintain the welding fillet of the 5 mm so this can also use in the fillet welding purpose this is very essential follow the same procedures to the another side also this time we can already sketch that profile from our latest part so we can also use convert entity to obtain that part profile so we can choose the thickness as it is as 5 mm and select the reverse direction so it can be helping fillet welding 
again select H flange to get the T profile and select the dimension to that profile at 700 mm click on OK now follow same procedures we now we need the profile so we need to select front face of the side flange or the side part then we can directly use the convert entity to get our front side or the back side of the T profile then simply select the T and click on convert entity then go to the sheet metals go to the base flange and simply reverse the thickness which helps us to get the edge to edge fitting of the plates then we need to draw the or we need to cover the top profile by using plate so we select the top face of the T then select the inner corners and draw the rectangle by using that then exit sketch go to the sheet metal go to the base flange and select the thickness is 5 mm and select the thickness at the outer side of the reverse direction which helps us in welding which measures the 5 mm fillet so this is our T duct this is the industrial design so you can also apply in the industry this is generally used in sugar plants or the steam plants if you like the video then subscribe my channel if you are new in our family then subscribe my channel and like the video so thank you